The number one word a narcissist cannot stand. There is one word the narcissist cannot stand. And the reason why they cannot stand this word is because they want to have control over you. They want to have the ability to influence your behavior and direct the course of events. They want to be superior to you. They want to have influence and authority over you. They want to be able to dominate you. They want everything to suit their premeditated strategy. They want everything to suit their preferences. They are self-absorbed and they lack empathy. Everything has to be about them. And they want you to understand that so that you can keep it going. If you try to deviate from their intended course which they have laid out for you, they will get very angry. They will argue with you. In their minds, they believe that they are the bearers of truth and they expect you to see it the same way. If they can't get a reaction out of you, they might just ignore you. They might give you the silent treatment. Even if you do try to express your ideas and preferences, they will just invalidate you. They will always find a way to be in opposition to you because they see it as though that then gives them power over you. They will force their selfish agenda onto you. They will pressure you until you finally give in. Most often whatever is good for them will usually be at your expense. Whatever they expect you to do for them, they don't feel that they need to do the same thing in return. They have double standards. They always have to see themselves as a priority. As though they are more important than other people. And they expect everything to go according to their ideas and preferences. They don't want to put their attention on anyone else's needs other than their own. They will endlessly reject your proposals and ideas and they will endlessly invalidate you. But if you were to do the same thing to them, it would cause a narcissistic injury. Which is why the number one word a narcissist cannot stand is no. The narcissist has to be significant and important. They have to be relevant. And to do that, they just focus heavily on their own self-importance. while dragging you along with it. They are so heavily focused on their ideas and preferences and they demand for you to have the same priorities as they do. They think that they know it all. They think that they understand life better than most people do. So they expect you to follow their commands. They always have to have the final word. They believe that their needs are more important than your needs. So they expect to be treated as the priority in every, situ every situation. They expect to be regarded as something important. If you disagree with them or take some time to focus on yourself, 
It will cause a narcissistic injury. They will make threats against you. Or they will give you the silent treatment. They will punish you for having a different opinion. Or for trying to do your own thing outside of their world. They don't care about your thoughts and opinions. They always have to be right. And if you try to do things your way, they will make threats against you. They will threaten to reveal private information about you to the public. They will threaten to expose you. Because they can't stand it that you said no to them. They can't deal with rejection. They want to have authority over you. They want to be superior to you. And they expect you to be their subordinate. They expect you to follow their commands. Narcissists often engage in impulsive behaviours where they feel a sudden, strong and unreflected urge or desire to do something. And they want to drag you along with it. They want you to make it a reality. They cannot accept any criticism or feedback. They cannot accept any alternative suggestions. They are emotionally immature. They have a childlike mentality. They will be nice to you if they want something. But if you say no to them, they will throw a temper tantrum. It makes them want to dominate you. It makes them want to put you beneath them. But you don't have to play their game. All they want is supply. They want you to feed their egos. They want you to prop up their false self. And they expect you to do that by being their subordinate. By letting them have the authority and control. As long as you give your power away to them like that, you are giving them supply. Narcissists are hungry for attention and admiration. They have a constant need to feed their egos. They are always trying to get a reaction out of you, which they can then use to feed themselves. They will try to make you angry or upset. They will try to make you defend yourself. They will push and provoke you to react to them. Because any reaction will feed them. As long as they feel like they were the cause of it. When you feed into it. And you give them reactions. It is fuel for their souls. The number one word a narcissist cannot stand is no. And if you say no to the narcissist, it will make them very angry. There's no telling what they might do to get revenge on you. So instead of saying no, stop reacting to them emotionally. Narcissists are like actors. 
they love the reactions they get out of you. It makes them want to go deeper and deeper into their role. But if you just take your attention away from them, they've got nothing to feed off. They want you to be their audience. Their primary motive is to keep you engaged. They want all of your attention to be on them. Which is why the best thing to do around a narcissist is to disengage. Rather than giving your emotional stability to an unstable person. Instead of being their audience and giving them all of your attention. You need to be the star of your own movie. You need to realize that you have your own life to live. You have your own ideas and preferences of what you want to do. You want to build healthy connections with people. But the narcissist cannot connect to you. They lack empathy. And they only want to keep you engaged so they can elevate themselves at your expense. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching.narcsurvivor.co.uk. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.